we have here is a, uh, is a demonstration, live demonstration to show how tough the process is. So we have a steel ball. It's a 135 gram steel ball. It's an industry standard for doing ball drop test. Uh, my colleague Kevin here would He's going to show you the demonstration here. So what we're going to do is take a 0.8 millimeter uh, competitor aluminosilicate glass. It's already been pre-scratched with a 7 newton force. And we're going to release the ball. And the ball hits. We're going to see what happens with the impact. Then. There you go. In that case, the glass actually broke in pieces. You can see all this cracking in there. So now with the same setup, we're going to load the ball back and this time we're going to use a Gorilla Glass 3. It's a 0.7, it's thinner than that glass. And again, it's been scratched the same exact way with the 7 Newton force. We're going to release the ball and see what happens. With the impact, nothing happened to the glass, it's a ball. So next we're going to take it a little further. That was a 10 degree incline, now we're going to increase it to 30 degrees which actually increases the impact energy three times higher. So just to show that, we're going to put a metal plate. It's a 0.77 millimeter thick metal plate. It's thicker than the glass. We're going to release and see what that impact energy is going to do. You see that has a big dent in the, glass, in the uh, metal plate. That's how much they do get a feel for the impact energy. Now we're gonna use the same setup, same incline, put our Gorilla Glass 3, 0.7 millimeter. Again, this has already been scratched with seven newtons. Release the ball. Even a three times higher impact energy, this glass still survived. No damage. Now Kevin's gonna take the same piece and put it in this little lever press and apply a hundred pound force and you, as you can see it's 110 and the glass is still intact did not break